Hello there, AGP here, aka Aurora Guinevere Price, here with an end of the month vlog update. So first, I would like to talk to you about things that are happening with me in the world of Amnesia, The Dark Descent. I'm still currently working on Helena. I've nearly finished the first map. Some detailing, some tweaking is going on. I'm trying to make it look as good as it possibly can. I still need to add in some last minute voiceover stuff and uh, get that all edited up and thrown together. I have made some more voiceover appearances in some Amnesia mods, most recently in Heartbeat, uh, the demo for Monsters, and The Barn's Secret. Uh, unfortunately, I haven't really been able to go through much of any of them, so I can't tell you much outside of that I did some voices for those. Um, I did play for a bit of Monsters, not very much, just a little bit. Um, it's basically a sort of amnesia version of Pokemon. And I voice a box. You should check it out. Also, in addition to all that other stuff, uh, Penumbra Necrolog, which I did the voice for Emma Bell Swanson in that, was recently greenlit on Steam, so you can now find it on, on Steam. As opposed to just downloading it off the internet, you can actually now get it through Steam, um, but you do have to have the actual, you know, amnesia base game in order to, to play it. So if you, if you don't have amnesia, you should probably get it. Just saying. But branching out into other voiceover stuff that I've done, one of my most recent projects has been a let's dub for To The Moon. For those of you who know, To The Moon is an RPG game and it's very heavily story driven and very heavily character driven and it will make you cry your eyeballs out and I'm so happy to have been a part of this project no idea because the story literally just thinking about it and hearing the music from it makes me want to burst into tears and not like sad depressed tears but like happy confused tears it's, it's pretty amazing. That's also another one. If you haven't heard of it or you don't know what it is, you should definitely check it out. Unfortunately, as of late, I have been taking on a few too many projects and it's kind of, it's been bulking up my schedule in that I have work now, I have YouTube, I have school, and I have all these other projects that I'm doing. Um, so as of the moment, I've stopped taking new voiceover work and any other projects really until I can get a lot of what I currently have done or what I have that I need to get done is done. Yeah. I also want to say that lately I've been seeing a lot of people complaining on YouTube videos about people overreacting and complaining about how certain people play in games with collabs and stuff. And honestly, it's getting really irritating because a lot of the times you have to think of this from the content creator's point of view. Well, yes, there are many people out there who do overreact. Sometimes there are just moments where that is just how you naturally are in that moment. I know looking back through a lot of my videos, it might seem like I'm overreacting, but honestly, that's just kind of how I am. You can ask my friends that try to watch movies with me, that kind of happens. And it's not that I'm overreacting, it's just that I'm having fun with it, and that's just the kind of monster I turn into when I get involved with these games or movies or anything. I just kind of turn into a crazy monster, and I'm not over overreacting, I think, has more of a negative connotation to it that the people who are reacting to it don't necessarily feel the things that they're feeling or they're exaggerating what they're feeling. And in this case, it's not that we're over exaggerating, it's usually that we're just really excited and we kind of just become awkward in that moment. It's not overreacting, it's just being weird and awkward and happy. I am currently recording for Resident Evil Remake Remastered. That is in the works. You should see that by Monday. Um, I haven't fully finished recording it. I do plan on doing both Jill and Chris prior to moving on to uh, Resident Evil 2. And in other news, Revelations 2 is coming out February 24th. I don't know how far I'm going to get in the Resident Evil Marathon prior to that. Um, I'm hoping that I won't have to stop in the middle of my marathon to play it. Um, unfortunately, it is going to be an episodic game, so... Eh. Eh. I also recently got a few comments about doing the discussion bowl. Um, 
I had stopped doing that for a very specific reason. Um, unfortunately, some things have happened and things did not quite work out the way things were intended to go. So for the time being, until things can get back on track, um, I may bring back the discussion bowl only for a few episodes. Gosh dang it, Twitch, you interrupted me with your German emails. Our current subscriber number is 335 as of right now when I last looked at YouTube. Pretty awesome, good number. Thank you guys for subscribing and being awesome people and for thinking that my crazy insanity is worthy of your viewing time. You guys are great. I love ya. I am currently working on a Spreadshirt store. Um, Kat Minyan, who does a lot of the chibi art that you see featured in the videos and thumbnails, has kindly offered to um, let me use her art in the store. Uh, part of the profit will go towards her since it is her art, um, and the rest of the money will be put towards growing and expanding the channel. I want to hear from you guys what products you would like to see, which have been your most favorite chibi art that you would really like to see featured in the store. Basically, just what do you guys want? Because the Spreadshirt store is for you guys. It's for you guys. So I want to know what you guys want. Tell me. Tell me what you want. Also, if you have any ideas for videos, I am trying to do a bunch of fresh content. I'm trying to come up with new ideas that aren't just straight gameplay. I want to do some more other things like, I don't know, movie reviews or something. Well, they won't be too fantastically in-depth in production value since I don't have the time to allow me to do something more in-depth. I would like to be able to post some other stuff for you guys that isn't just gameplay. Maybe if you have something in particular, like a voiceover thing you want to see, or just something else. Shoot me a suggestion, I will listen because I am up to ideas right now. I'm coming up with a list of my own, but I would really like to hear from you guys. Since you guys are the ones who watch, I want to know what you guys think. So basically, just send me your input, you guys. What you think about the channel, where is it going, what you would like to see, uh, stuff about the store, if there's any videos. Also, let me know how you guys are liking the two Binding of Isaac videos that I've done so far. I have That's about all I've had recorded so far, but if you guys like it... I can easily record some more and throw them up there for you guys if you want that. Uh, if you want to see something else, let me know. Um, just, just let me know. But I'm really hoping to get back into the swing of these. Um, every month I want to kind of update you on what's going on either in my life or what's going on with the channel or what's happening or get your guys' input. And I'm going to try to do these at the end of every month. So basically as opposed to doing like every so often a vlog update i'm just gonna do these little concentrated vloggy things once a month if you do want more consistent updates on what's going on with me or the channel i would suggest following my twitter since i tend to be more active there than anywhere else i'm not super active on social media but if you want to try to keep up to date with stuff that's going on that's probably your best place to go oh I just realized I've probably been flashing you guys this whole time. I'm sorry. I swear I'm not turning into that one chick who spams on everybody's videos. So anyway, this has been AGP, aka Aurora Guinevere Price. And I will see you all later. I don't know what I'm doing with my life. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh...